It was on Friday that shark biologist Dr. Nicholas Payne received a message from a Swiss tourist who had made an unusual discovery while out walking on the beach at Kilmore Quay. As soon as we got a look at the teeth, we could tell this was a really important and unusual um, sighting. So this species is a, a small toothed sand tiger shark and it's normally found in deep water offshore. And in fact, it's never been seen in Ireland before. So. As soon as our team saw that this animal had washed up here, we knew we had to get straight down to it and try to learn as much as we could about the animal. Just weeks ago, a similar shark washed up on the South English coast, and the weekend discovery here is believed to be unprecedented for Irish shores. No, I haven't seen this type of shark. I don't know why it's called a small toad shark, because he has. <laughs> but uh, the reason it's here, I don't know. Is it global warming or is it just, uh, it could be the food. We've had fin whales all along this coast and humpback whales in the winter time. Like people have said to me, is it global warmer? Well, I don't know for sure. But what they do know from sure is that they're here feeding. I could believe it. Surely would be unusual, eh? As we're down here to see today. It, it's worrying because I usually not see anything like that around here. You usually get basket sharks at the most, but a predatory shark is usually not seen. But there's no cause for alarm among sea users. It's definitely safe to go back in the water. Uh, even if uh, these sharks were around, they wouldn't be a threat to humans, but, we're, but they are not around. They normally live in much deeper waters where humans don't go anyway. The marine biologists at Trinity College are now examining the remains of the shark to try and learn more about the species and maybe find out how it ended up here. Connor Kane, RT News, Kilmore Key, County Wexford.